today I am pretty pumped because why do I say that every time? I am actually finishing my last final today at school. So it is so exciting today because after I finish that, I'm just going to be like <sighs> relieved, have so much more time, can actually enjoy the holidays and not stress. So um, I just woke up and obviously, <laughs> and I'm just making some breakfast. So I just wanted to show you guys what I've been loving lately. First off, let's get Roxy. Roxy, you want to come in? Okay, so what I've been loving, and I actually saw it off of, I believe her name's Melissa Merck. She's on YouTube, and um, she introduced me to this, and I am obsessed. So the first thing is the Oikos. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. But it's the Greek non-fat yogurt. This is in the plain. I will have to say that it is extremely plain. Like when they say plain, they're not joking. But after you add everything in, it tastes a lot better. And then I cut up strawberries. I usually cut up about three. And I usually do like two um, scoops of that. Then I put granola on it. And then just sprinkle some chocolate chips. Excuse my horribly cracked phone. But yeah, it's just a lot healthier than normally what I eat because normally I eat like pancakes and, you know, biscuits, nothing really healthy. So I would say I do like two and a half. And yeah, so I'm just going to make my breakfast and... It is just so early right now. Can't even deal. My strawberries in here. And you can add like any berry you like. So you could just totally change this up. Chocolate chips are the best part. Whoa. Kind of have to be careful not to go a little crazy. Though. Then I have my breakfast. Kind of looks weird all mixed up, but pretty good, guys. And, oops, somebody's up. <laughs> good morning. <laughs> <laughs> Macy's been sick, so she's staying home from school. But yeah, just gonna eat my breakfast and watch some Good Morning America and then get ready. No. Let's find the elf. What? We found the elf. He still has Carol from yesterday. This is Peppermint, and I named him. <laughs> he's pretty mischievous. Mischievous. But today he's. Yesterday he was in the candy bowl with empty wrappers and caramel all over his face. I guess it's time to get ready. <laughs> and it is like. It's kind of gloomy outside. It's not really raining, but it's still gloomy. But do y'all ever have those days where, like, okay, I swear to you, I will go to bed, like, get into bed at, like, let's say 10 o'clock, and I'm like, oh, I'm going to go to bed early. And I literally stay up till 1 in the morning just thinking like I don't have a TV in my room because I haven't like got anything hooked up to get a TV so like there's nothing to distract me so all I'm I'm just thinking and thinking and like I will just get the best ideas when I'm asleep and I just can't do nothing about it because I'm just laying there and I'll just think about all of these 
makeup ideas and you know oh I'm gonna do this makeup look and then I wake up and I'm like I don't even want to wear makeup like that is my struggle every day <laughs> so I'm just going to put on some music and get myself ready because I gotta have music to get me going okay guys so I am running extremely late. I told myself I was gonna get up early so I could have enough time to study some more for um, this test I'm fixing to take. But, of course, I get distracted and don't get ready in time. So, Looks like I'm gonna be studying on the way. So, oh, this is what happens when you procrastinate, but can't do anything else about it. Um, I'll just show my outfit later on today because, I mean, I'm gonna be vlogging a lot today because after I get out, I've got to run a few errands and then me and Nathan are going to Bowling Green. I've gotta go by Hobby Lobby for a few things and just gonna take you all with me. Right now, I'm gonna study on my way to school. Wish me good luck on my finals. I'm done with finals. Oh, I'm done with finals. Oh, y'all don't understand how good it feels to be done with finals. And these people are staring at me, so that's all right. But, um, yeah, I just had, the last final I had was communication final. Let's put our seatbelt on. And it went pretty good. I was honestly expecting it to be a lot worse. Last night I tried to study and my eyes just like started crossing. I was like, forget this. There's no way I can study. And then this morning my sister was trying to help me study, but good thing about me is I can memorize really well so I'm very lucky about that because normally when I look over something a couple times like I have a good picture memory so I can remember where it's at and I don't know it's weird but the point is I'm done with finals and I have so much time now um, even though I'm gonna be working I'll still have you know so much time I'm just so excited and we don't go back to school till January 26th. And I know that kind of sounds like a long time, but it comes by very quick. So I'm gonna spend this time making more videos for you all, getting them up, um, by, uh, working on Christmas presents because this year I decided um, just for money reasons to, um, because I do like to paint and draw and do, you know, artwork. So, I'm going to do a lot of paintings for gifts this year. Um, and plus, I mean, who wouldn't want a gift that's, you know, made by someone? I mean, I would rather get a gift that was made rather than bought. So, it'll save me money and it's a good gift to get someone. It is so cold outside. Um, I could not find, I could not figure out what I was going to wear because I just couldn't. I mean, there are days where I think I know what I'm going to wear and then I'm just like, no, it just doesn't look good. And it's always the days that I'm running late that I can't figure out what to wear. So I'll just end up showing you all my outfit later. But I am headed to Nathan's. We are going to leave there. And we're going, I've got to drop by my stepdad's work and pick up something from him. And then we're going to head to Bowling Green. I am craving Panera so bad. I don't know what it is, but um, I'm craving the, it's whatever Chai Bella gets. Um, what is that? It's like the Chipotle, Chipotle chicken something. And um, I really want soup. But with that sandwich, like the Caesar salad is so good. Like their Caesar salad is on point and is the best I've ever had. So I kind of want that. Um, Nathan usually doesn't like Panera, but we never get to go and I'm gonna 
I'm going to talk about two. I had to show you these because they're too cute not to show you. But my grandma actually um, sews and just throughout the year she sews um, like these little pins. Um, she does like different seasons. Like look at this little onesie. Look! <laughs> but um, during the Christmas she makes Christmas ones and during you know different holidays and she hands them out to um, you know waitresses she takes them to the fire department um, to the police departments she is just a saint my grandma is so these are just a few that she makes and they're just felt and little designs this is a little owl um, penguin a snowman another snowman and I think this year there's Santa this year she um made a few of the Olaf's and people like went crazy over them and she barely like she doesn't even sell them like she gives them away and um but yeah they're just the cutest things and she also makes um stockings and I really wish I could show you because they are so cute. I have got the worst headache, so we'll probably go eat first. Nathan really doesn't want Panera. He wants toots, but craving Panera. So we just got our food, and it looks delicious. I got the Chipotle chicken panini for the Caesar salad, and if y'all never had their Caesar salads, they are amazing. Nathan got a grilled cheese and potato soup so we're gonna dig in is that your first time eating it huh yeah. well nathan how would you say that you're left how would you say your first experience of panera was it was good it was good he wasn't that impressed no he wanted toots but he was nice enough to go because I was craving it. Um, you can go. We could take a shortcut through here. But now I'm full and I feel much better. And I don't have a headache no more. So ready to go. We're headed to Hobby Lobby. And I'll definitely vlog in there because all of the Christmas stuff, it's overwhelming. It's just. I feel like before YouTube, I really didn't like care about Christmas decorations or like decorating my room. But then the more I've watched YouTube, like I'm obsessed with it. And I, that's all I wanna buy. <gasps> Look, there's Firehouse Subs. I am going to freaking kick your <laughs> booty. Are, are you kidding me right now? I bet it's not open though. I bet it is, it's no. been here for a while. No. Wanna put money on it? No, it they. At? There's a firehouse subs downtown. There's a firehouse subs around here. Yeah, there's one downtown, but that one probably just opened up. Oh, look at that truck. Them blue lights. Fancy. Nathan! Dude, get off that. Nathan! Oh my gosh, and it's freaking nice. I'm sorry. I didn't uh, I didn't know that. Nathan Which way am I going? Go keep going straight. Oh uh. <laughs> And there's salad works. What I've always wanted to try. But I've heard it's it's expensive too. Followers on a budget. This is what I'm looking at. $60. Oh, Lord of mercy. But I think they're 30% off. How much is 30% off? This is what I'm... I mean, that's not bad. I mean, that's... I just... I mean, that's the size I'm wanting that's going to go above my bed. Okay, get your calculator out. I mean, Hobby Lobby always has some good sales. 
um, do 70 times 0. 0.30. $21 off. Oh, and that's, so do 70 minus plus tax plus times 1.06. You think it's worth it? I don't think it's worth it. I'm just so upset that that's how much that is. But my baby. Look at these easels. They're really nice. I'm so upset, guys. <sighs> I went in there. My plan was to get the canvas <gasps> to make for my bedroom. And I thought I would get, you know, get a good deal because if I'm making it, it's going to be a lot cheaper. But the canvas was still going to be about $60. Plus, I needed to get paint for it and a spatula for this texture that I was gonna make. And yeah, we didn't really, uh, <clears throat> we didn't really go um, through the Christmas stuff because we just kind of skinned through it. I was going to, okay dude, get over. But um, I'm, I plan on making um, Christmas, Christmas ornament wreaths, wreaths. And uh, I think I'm going to do a DIY video on it. But in there, I mean, their stuff is half off. But I think you can get all of this stuff at like a dollar store. And they are so cute after you make them. So I think that's what I'm going to do is make those. And I guess, I guess I'm going to look around um, to see if there are any more uh, paintings. But if you all have any suggestions of where to get like huge... Um, not necessarily paintings but like simple um canvases with designs my theme is more like a gold silver or white um where are we going um, you can go to dollar general and buy a scan. okay we'll go to i want to go to the ballast okay sometime go to and gander probably no both okay go right here but let me know if you have any suggestions of where to get those. I mean, I know they're going to be more expensive anywhere, pretty much, because, I mean, the bigger the canvas, the bigger, or the more it is. But I'm very picky, and what I was going to make was going to be so cute. But if I can't find anything that is cheap enough, I might just make it. You see that right there? Got busted in the face. We went by Starbucks and I actually saw this um, drink on Pinterest. And I don't know if any of you all know, but my favorite flavor of like ice cream and anything is white chocolate raspberry. So um, this is white chocolate mocha with two pumps of raspberry and whipped cream. Oh, Nathan. Oh, gosh, you made me nervous. So, let's get this taste on camera. Okay, ready? Well, let me try this again. I know you take your bells. Straight. <laughs> chocolate mocha but the aftertaste is awful you just paid five dollars for something you didn't like <laughs> uh, 
I'll drink it if I paid $5 for it. Hey, let me see that real quick. Let me see this real quick. Oh, oh. Okay, so this is kind of an idea of the deer stand we're gonna be in. I think it's called a it's called a buddy stand. So we're gonna be chilling up in the trees together. It's pretty nice in here. This is what I'm talking about. This is the food area. I love these types of grills right here. Like I just like the way they look. These are the GoPros. I think that one of these would be so cool to have. You could just like put it on anything. Hey guys, so sorry I haven't been filming like any more a lot today. But um, once we got home, I just kind of took a nap because I was just kind of blah. But um, Nathan's fixing to go play basketball, so I'm fixing to go to the gym because it has been way too long for me not to go. So, I thought I'd show a little OOTD or OOTN. Um, this is just an Under Armour shirt. Um, and just I have just got a white sports bra on. And these are also Under Armour. These are from Hibbets, I believe. And they are literally the comfiest... Um, pants ever and they have this design which is really cute I don't know if you can see it's like a black and silver and then of course I have my Nike um, tennis shoes on because I've had these forever this is probably going to be the last vlog of the night because um, Nathan went and played basketball I went to the gym and actually stayed there a while and uh, I feel so much better after going and um, we just ate and picked up around his place and now we are playing Call of Duty. I used to make fun of it how much he used to play and then here I am now I play. But I'm pretty good at it. I'm getting pretty good. Oh, I'm so comfy. Every time I come to Nathan's I wear the same thing every time. And I, yeah, I always end up taking his clothes and he doesn't know where they end up going, but we're in my house. We probably uh, won't stay up late because we're going hunting bright and early. Hunting? Hunting? Hunt? We're going hunting. We're going hunting. Hey, yeah. And yeah, and I said hunting last time you were like, hunting? <laughs> but we gotta get up about four o'clock. About four o'clock, we ain't gonna be out there now. Four o'clock, we'll be out there about six o'clock. But we gotta get up before, right? No, we got about five thirty. You said we had to be out there before the thing. It don't. So does okay. No, I'll get me out. <laughs> but um, yeah. So that's what we're gonna be doing. I'll be fine as long as I've got coffee, and then after I got coffee, I'll be awake. So, I'm fixing to kick Nathan's butt in some Call of Duty, and then we're probably going to go to bed. And we'll see you bright and early. Good morning, everyone. It is 5.46, and I am actually the one who woke Nathan up. He told me that he was going to be the one to get up early, and he was still sleeping. So... I got him up and so early, but I'm just making coffee because I gotta have coffee to wake up. My hair, I don't even know what it's doing and I'm definitely not putting makeup on. Don't feel like it. I mean, it has been so long since I've actually made coffee in a coffee pot. Because normally I'm making coffee out of like a Keurig. Well, you probably can't see me very well, but I just wanted to go ahead and vlog before we went out there because obviously I can't film while we're hunting. Um, 
so yeah we're fixing to go out there and before the sun comes up and hopefully Nathan kills something we're pretty pretty warm but it's pretty cold outside well we just left and when we first this jacket is like huge. When we first got there, we actually heard some deer and we thought they were really, well, they were really close to We thought they were gonna come up there, but they ended up not coming and, but it's okay. I think Nathan's gonna get a trail camera and set it up and see what's all up there. But we'll probably just head back. It's only 10 o'clock now, so just go get something to eat and yeah fun day <laughs>